A WHEN SERVICEMEN AND WOMEN COME BACK FROM WAR, IT CAN BE HARD TO FIND A JOB. BUT NOW THERE ARE NEW INCENTIVES FOR COMPANIES TO HIRE THEM. TEN IN YOUR SIZE MELANIE WOODROW IS HERE TO EXPLAIN. MEL? STEPHANIE, THE JOBLESS RATE AMONG IRAQ AND AFGHANISTAN VETERANS IS HIGHER THAN THE NATIONAL UNEMPLOYMENT RATE. REWARDS FOR COMPANIES HIRING VETERANS COULD CHANGE THAT. AT NORMA ELIZABETH SALON, TONITA COOPER FOUND A NEW LIFESTYLE. This is the Army veteran's second career. Cooper says the transition wasn't perfectly smooth. Especially if, say, you have kids or, you know, you've been in the military for a long time. Still, she considers herself one of the lucky ones. Many veterans have trouble finding civilian work. For some, the situation is especially bleak. You see a lot of veterans that's homeless. National and local initiatives are aimed at changing that this Veterans Day. First Lady Michelle Obama announced the International Franchise Association is committed to hiring 80,000 veterans and military spouses by 2014. I think it's a very good idea. Yesterday, the Senate overwhelmingly approved tax credits for companies hiring unemployed military veterans. And locally, Opportunity Inc. launched the Hire a Vet Hampton Roads website. They also launched an employer's guide to hiring exiting military personnel and other veterans in Hampton Roads. Efforts to ensure those who work to protect our safety will have work when they transition to a new life phase. More chances and vets need more chances. The tax credit legislation goes to the House next. We'll put a link to the Hire a Vet Hampton Roads website on our website, wavy.com. Melanie Woodruff, 10 on your side.